Hey there everyone, today I want to show you Microsoft Whiteboard. This is a really cool tool where you can collaborate online with as many people as you want in a blank canvas. So uh, there's a number of different things that do this. I think this does really, really nicely. So uh, if you sign in with your school account, you can see I've signed in here and I'm going to create a new whiteboard. You just get a blank space on the screen. Now I've got my pen here so I can write on the screen you can choose different colors and different styles and all of that sort of thing. So I'm going to write on the screen and I can zoom out and zoom in. So I get this real big infinite canvas all the time. I can grab that writing if I want like that and I can make it nicer or I can move it around. So it actually transforms your text into a nicer text if you want to. And all of these shapes then can be moved around on the screen or I can delete uh, parts of the shapes. And you can see I've got different colors. Uh, different combinations. I've got a ruler there and I can manipulate that on the screen uh, just like I can sort of in a OneNote and then draw on it and create a straight line. So you've got a number of the different uh, options there using your pen uh, that you do in, in OneNote options as well. So what can I add on here? I can paste what's ever on my clipboard whether that's text or an image. I can add an image on there. I can put some text on this page so just type some text in there and again it makes it really easy for move to move this text around uh, i can put a note on there an image i can take something from the camera or i can put a sticker on there as well so if i want to i can put the planet earth on there and choose that and move it around it's a really easy nice canvas that i can use to collaborate on Okay, here's another canvas that I've been uh, collaborating on with two other people. So in this canvas here, we're talking about library design and I can share a link to this uh, with a number of other people. They can also collaborate on here. So while I'm on here and circling and uh, writing some text on here, um, I can also make some notes. So you can see that these things are being put in by other people, not by me. Um, so I can make some notes on there if I want to. You can see it's kind of making my text nice as I write. Other people can write notes as they like. You can see on the screen which people or who it is that's adding things on the screen as they go by because they're also members of my school community. Uh, so we can collaborate on this space and save and export this space that we've been working on really, really nicely. It's a great collaborative tool um, for working together. You'll see here that I can <clears throat> invite people. So I can search for the people that I want to invite to this, or I can just create a sharing link. So the web sharing link is on. So if I copy that link and give it to people, anybody with that link can then access whiteboard and access this board that we're working on. Not all of mine, but just this particular board. I can also, of course, add people. Um, so if I just type in Ian, it will recognize, oh Ian, okay, that's the person that I want to, so I can invite Ian also to either edit or just read the board that it is that we've been looking at. I can also post uh, the board to Teams or I can also send this work that we're doing here to OneNote, which is another cool idea, all right? So uh, that is some of the nice options that you get as you're working together on a collaborative workspace here on whiteboard as you can see other people are adding their ideas for some nice library designs over on the right hand side i've got my active pen going ink to shape which means when i create when i draw a shape a simple shape like a rectangle like this <laughs> or a pentagon it automatically inks to that um, and the other things there we've got ink to table object snapping i can export this whiteboard as an image or a high quality image uh, after we've finished with it i can format the background so in the background i can change the colors so we might want to change a different color or I can have a square background or just any kind of background. So I can change the background styles in there, which is nice uh, and clear everything all at once over there on the side. Um, and here we are working together on this collaborative workspace and some ideas about library design. So this is Microsoft Whiteboard. It all happens in real time as we're doing it and a nice little tool. Check it out. The first time you go in there, uh, download the app from the Microsoft Store and we're all working together on the app here. But you can also uh, give a link to people and they can work also in the browser. So there you go. There's uh, an intro to Microsoft Whiteboard.